Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Tyler Day. If you don't know who I am, I'm the co-founder of OptimizedToConvert.com. Um, OptimizedToConvert.com is a brand that I run with my brother Peter, which is all about affiliate marketing. So we've been doing affiliate marketing since 2012, and we've generated eight figures in revenue in the space. And now we're still doing affiliate marketing. We're still actually in the trenches every day, running ad campaigns, testing offers, and making money doing affiliate marketing. And what we like to do as well is we like to put out free content on YouTube to uh, basically help the community, okay? So if you don't know about our brand, go ahead and check out our blog, OptimizeToConvert.com. We have a um, bunch of content on the blog. We have a free group that you can join called Affiliates Ask Anything. Um, we have a whole bunch of free training on our YouTube channel, so on and so forth. So. Today, the topic that we're going to be talking about is how much money can you make as an affiliate marketer, okay? So the answer to that question is not really black or white because, you know, really the amount of money that you're going to be able to make as an affiliate marketer is really going to be directly proportional to your skill. So really the secret to making more money as an affiliate marketer is basically increasing your skill. And, you know, once you have the skill, then it's, um, you know, it's a lot easier to make more money once you actually know what you're doing, okay? So, usually how the growth curve goes for actually making money with affiliate marketing is that it starts out very, very, very slow and then it sort of um, ramps up once you um, have the, the appropriate skill, okay? So... I'll tell you a little bit about my journey and sort of how we actually started to make money online as affiliates, okay? So I started out in 2012, basically in my college dorm room, um, just trying to figure stuff out. I was just trying all sorts of different methods like blogging or eBay and um, Bing ads and blog, you know, all, all sorts of different things. Um, you know, we were even trying magazine ads and, you know, mailing postcards to people's homes to try to get people to convert into affiliate offers. And really, we ended up, you know, not making money. We ended up losing money during this period of time, a three year period of time. We did not make any money. But after three years of trial and error in 2015, we basically hit it big and we did three million dollars in revenue that year. And you know, since, since then, there hasn't been a year that we've uh, done less than that in business revenue. Um, you know, 2016 was my junior year of college, and I remember earning multiple six figures that year and just being ecstatic about the level of income that I was able to produce with affiliate marketing. And it, and it got me hooked. You know, I'm still here doing affiliate marketing um, here in 2020, so much further down the road, and we're still making a full-time income doing it, you know. I remember in 2017, it was my senior year of college, you know, one year after our initial success with affiliate marketing. And, you know, I personally earned over $450,000 in income that year in profit. And so did Peter. I think Peter might have even earned more than that because um, he had some other income stuff going on other than me. So, yeah, I mean, it's it's a real industry and there's definitely real money to be made doing this. Um, but like I said, it's it's not a get rich quick overnight thing. I mean, you know, it takes a long time to actually start earning money, especially if you don't have any money and you don't have any skill. Um, so let's talk about how you acquire skill as an affiliate marketer. So really, there's only two ways to acquire skill. Either you can learn through trial and error, like you know, just doing things and failing at it and then trying different things and probably failing. And then over the course of a long time of trying to do this stuff, you can maybe figure out, um, you know, something that actually works, you know, very, very slow, long, monotonous approach. The other way that you can increase your skill is by basically getting mentorship. And, you know, after three years of trial and error, my brother Peter and I, we basically said enough is enough. And that's when we actually invested in our first mentor. So the first mentor, I forget how we even met him. I think, you know, somebody that I knew that was also kind of struggling with affiliate marketing was like, hey, I actually just met this guy, you know, in the library of my hometown. And, you know, he showed me how he was making like $300,000 a month promoting these affiliate offers online and, you know, 
it was crazy and I you know so I got the the mentor I got introduced to him by basically somebody that I knew and Peter and I ended up paying this guy um, a lot of money like I you know um, thousands and thousands of dollars we paid this guy for coaching uh, probably over ten thousand dollars I can't remember the exact amount but I remember at the time it was basically all the money that I had um, you know, in 2015, you know, we we'd just been working some side jobs and hustling up and scrapping and, you know, managed to save up just like a little bit of money. And Peter pooled our money together to basically pay this mentor. And within 30 days, Peter and I ended up doing $30,000 in profit from what that mentor showed us. And basically our skill was multiplied overnight. You know, the, the, the blinds were pulled off from our eyes as far as exactly what we needed to do. And we took that information and we ran with it. And really that, that, that coaching, that increase of skill really changed our lives forever because like I said, there hasn't been a year since that, that initial success that we've done less than $3 million in business revenue, okay? So when it comes down to actually making a, a full-time income, it really depends on how much time you're gonna be allocating towards your business too. Um, you know, the reason why it took me so long to start making money for those first three years is because I, w I was a college student and I also had another job on the side that I was, you know, scrapping away at to try to save up money to actually, you know, get the business off the ground. Um, so I didn't have a lot of time. I was, you know, in the back of the lecture hall on my computer trying to, you know, focus on two things at once and build the business. I, you know, would be in the library studying until, you know, 10 at night or, or later and then be, you know, online on the computer until one in the morning or, or later trying to actually, you know, start the business and get it off the ground. Um, and Peter was in the same boat because he was sort of in college at the same time I was and he had a bunch of other stuff on his plate. So, you know, really, we didn't have the most time in the world to allocate towards learning affiliate marketing, which is probably why it took us three years to figure it out. But, you know, if, if you have more than like a one or two hours per day or, you know, if you have like four or five hours per day to figure it out, um, you know, maybe you could reach success a little bit faster than we did, um, you know, especially if you have the right mentorship and stuff like that. Um, you know, Peter and I, we were a little bit cheap at first. Probably one of the biggest mistakes that we made at first was just not investing in mentors. I mean, we were buying courses that were helpful and we were learning things, but it wasn't quite the, the same as just having a one-on-one -on -one mentor actually show you something that's working, which finally in 2015, we did that and it changed everything for us. Okay, so when it, when it comes down to thinking about how much money you're gonna make in affiliate marketing, you know, I would, I would basically just try to really get the idea out of your head of trying to get rich overnight or even trying to get rich and make money within your first couple years of doing affiliate marketing because affiliate marketing, you know, especially learning paid advertising and the nuances of, you know, um, paid traffic and social media traffic, it can, it can just be so complicated and there can be so much trial and error involved that like, um, it, it's just not going to click overnight is what I'm trying to say. So really give yourself that, that, that right mindset that you can give yourself a long time to figure it out. And, you know, that's why I recommend if you're first getting started to have another job on the side too, that you can basically support yourself with while you're figuring out affiliate marketing. Um, you know, that's basically what Peter and I did. We, we, um, we were just working and, you know, trying to figure things out while, um, you know, doing what, whatever else we were doing, going to school and, and having, you know, side jobs that I was, you know, filling water glasses at a restaurant, stuff like that. So anyways, you know, you really do need to have the right mindset. And, you know, during that first three year period, I think that there was a lot of times where I wanted to give up, but fortunately I had sort of a, I really did have a good mindset. I started reading like personal development books at a very, very young age. And, you know, I really understood that, you know, it, it really does take people a long time to figure things out. You know, I was reading stories about people that struggled for 10 years before having their first successful business or, you know, three years, stuff like that. So I, I although I had big aspirations, I knew that 
nothing easy came overnight and any business that was worth having um, could potentially take me years to figure that out. Now, really our goal here at Optimize to Convert, um, you know, above and beyond just succeeding on our own campaigns is to really help other people cut down on that learning curve. Um, you know, I don't mean to brag, but we've had a lot of success stories. Um, we've had people go through our coaching programs that have hit ridiculous numbers, like $10,000 a day in revenue just within a couple months of um, finishing up their coaching with us. So really, we have a good track record of bringing people from newbie to very, very advanced in the space. And if you're looking to really take things to the next level, um, please go to our site, optimize to convert.com or optimize to convert.com forward slash products and check out our product offerings. So we have a case study here. Um, this is an actual example of an ad campaign that we ran. Um, it's very, very affordable. Um, and you know, this is something that could basically show you a good example of what an affiliate campaign looks like that's made money. And um, this is super valuable. There's nobody else sharing this kind of information for this price. I think one of these case studies costs $7. Okay, other than that, we have our course, The Social Lead Gen Blueprint, which if you've been trying to figure out Facebook ads or you wanna get into doing um, lead gen on Facebook, then this is the course for you because basically I lead you through you know, the beginner steps, A to Z, of just figuring things out on Facebook and I walk you through all the little nuances and all the, all the do's and don'ts and really give you some killer strategies that you can implement even on a small budget. So. This course is, um, is, is incredible. This is a new one that we just came out with and I highly recommend it. Okay, if you're super serious about taking things to the next level, we do have a one-on-one -on -one coaching with me um, called the Virtual Day in the Office. And this is very, very similar to the coaching format that you know, we had back in 2015 where basically we had a super affiliate show us you know, exactly what to do. And you know, I realize the value of this sort of coaching and, you know, that's why I'm offering this up. Um, you know, our time is not cheap, but it's super helpful to have somebody hold your hand and basically just show you exactly what to do and walk you through the do's and don'ts of actually, um, you know, becoming a successful affiliate. Anyways, guys, I'll see you in the next video.